Alright, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Gene Forge 1. Here on my channel, Idle Wisdom. We rejoin our hero here, or uh, our protagonist, anyways. I don't know if he's a hero or not. Um, Evodius. And he's here in the village of Thackeray. Home of the Awakened. So, last episode, if you recall, we traveled to East Cause over here, where we met. What was it? Veal Blade. <laughs> and fought a few rogues, talked to some people, found some interesting stuff. But now we have to decide where we are going to go next. We have quite a few options. Not sure what I want to do next, though. Because see here, okay, so we have the Servile Warren. Okay. We have the Refugee Cave. And I think that's where the outsider human rebels, the Shaolai rebels, who are, I guess, a splinter faction of Shalai that the Takers want dead, that, what's his face, Echo Blade has hired us to get rid of him. And if we want to get on the good side of the Takers, I bet you that's something we could do. Of course, I don't know why we would necessarily want to help outsider, I mean, help the Takers and do that. I mean, we don't know why those outsiders are, you know, splintered off from the main group of Shalai. Maybe they have good reasons. On the other hand, I don't know. Okay, then we have here, Holding 2, and I think the Icy Tunnels. On the other hand, we have a couple bridges. Guarded Bridge, Guarded Bridge. Those are Patrol Bridge. Those are very dangerous areas. Then we have the Junkyard. And the Dry Wastes. I'm wondering if we can maybe... I'm thinking, since I haven't made up my mind what I want to do with the Refugee Cave, we could go to Holding 2, or to the Servile Warren. Maybe the Servile Warren? Let's go to the Servile Warren. I was thinking maybe the Junkyard might be a good place. But let's try this Servile Warren first. Wow, that took me forever to th make up my mind. But, you know, I hadn't made up my mind. So, you know, there we are. What in the world is here? You enter a large ruined complex. There's been a lot of fighting here recently. There are lots of broken weapons and bloodstains on the floor. It looks like the Serviles of Kaz have been sending warriors into here, but they're meeting strong resistance. You suspect that there is that this is some sort of creation hall or place for training new Serviles. Educating Serviles is always a difficult job. They can be re very recalcitrant creatures, even in the best of circumstances. Uh, it's like they almost don't want to be... Um, <laughs> the slaves of shapers. That's, that's remarkable. Uh oh, here comes a greeter. You meet a small servile. His skin has a fresh, waxy look, and he has a vacant expression. He actually looks like a new creation. He doesn't have any of the presence of mind common to the serviles of this island. He starts to speak to you slowly and carefully. Shaper, I have shaper instruction. I am greeter. Well, what is this place? This is Servile Warren, where serviles made and taught by Control 3, but defended. I am here to warn, but not expect Shaper. You said you have special instructions if a Shaper comes? Control 3 defends, fills with creations to protect place from rogues, but Control 3 has become very weak. Creations attack all, beware. Will they even attack me? Creations attack all, they are to defend this place. Hmm, can anything be done to restore Control 3? It says it hungry. I know not what to do about it. And who made those creations? And who made you? Control 3. Even weak, it can command powers here. It makes new creations. They fight rogues who come in. Many rogues come in. Bad serviles. They kill. Anything else? What do you think of what do you think of what is going on outside this place? What is outside? You briefly explain the concept. The servile looks scared. <gasps> I have never been outside. Uh, okay, well. That does seem... Huh. Indoors, indoors, indoors. Oh, I'm sorry, he's scared now. Because I told him about that horrible, scary place called Outside. When a servile completed its growth and training and a shaper took it away, the servile was signed out in this book. The task the servile was trained in is listed alongside the date and the name. The last entries are from about 200 years ago. Huh. Uh-oh. Roamers. Guardian roamers, I bet you. Let's see. 
Yep, guardian roamers. Pretty dangerous, actually. Okay, you guys need to get your accuracy up. Oh, and they're poisoning. That's great, too. Oh, wow, this is not good at all. Okay, how about we stop sucking it up? Do you think that would be possible? Maybe? Just maybe? Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> Let's heal. One. Uh oh, careful, Vodius. We're gonna get your. Oh, man. Get him! Ah! This is aggravating. Say, I wonder if we're ready for this place. Hmm. Ow! Oh yeah, gotcha! 30 experience. That's not bad. Not bad. Oh, come on, dude. Dude. Aha! Now you're poisoned. Oh, yeah, and you got punch. And poison. And whatever that. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Let's see. Let's cure. If I remember correctly, there's a lot of... A lot of annoying, poisonous rumors in this place. Shit and armor, or kite and armor. Iron shield, eh. I think I'm gonna leave it for now. Who cares? Wow, that was annoying. I think we're gonna need to use some support magic in this place. Not just everyone in. See these? They patrol this whole facility. Oh, come on, yo. <laughs> Let's use this blessing rod. And then... Yeah, yeah, eat that! Oh, yeah, right in the freaking head. You got punched. Oh, nothing. Oh, that's, that's good. I, I like it when we find nothing. <laughs> well, then you'd be happy now. That's right. Yeah, nothing. Woohoo! Nothing! Come on. Thods guard the door. No, 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 no. Get the treasure chest. Alright. We got a shielding pod. And a fine cloak. Yeah, big deal. Fine cloak. Nice in the early part of the game. Not useful at all now. Coated cloak and... Oh, we just have a garbage tunic. I did not even realize that. We need something better than just a regular old tunic. I had not noticed that we that's all we have. These chambers are where, are where rebellious servals were brought to have their behaviors modified. You've never seen a place like this before. Most shapers tend to avoid them since they can be very unpleasant. Of course, it hasn't been used for many years. Huh, that's interesting. They don't want to see what goes on. How, how delicate. Okay. I think maybe, hmm. You, get up there. What is, there's two turrets. Burning turret, and a venom turret. The venom turret is the less dangerous of the two. You come back here. I don't... Oh, no, we can't. All right, well, whatever. I would like to have a, a thawd that's not... A thawd to cover our back. Haste, every, haste people up. Yeah. Actually, yes, let's... Can you get back here? Yes, you can. All right, cool. How about right here? Can you shoot? No, you can't. Oh, that's just lovely. You're 
next to useless. Not quite useless, but just next to useless. Yeah, you come right here. Oh, ow! Oh, that sounds like it hurts. <laughs> Ten. All right, can you hit him? Yes. Dead. Woo. And get him. No, no, no. That pause is when the... Oh, come on. Enemy units are moving somewhere on the field. Just not where we can see them. Actually, Vodius, you stay right here. You don't need to get shot by some darn turret. <laughs> yeah, Vodius would just get impaled with one shot. Most likely. Alright, cool. Alright. And you... Cure... Three. Excellent. And... Heal... Three. What's over here? Actually, we should probably save. The game definitely takes a sort of a difficulty jump. I think starting somewhere around this point in the game, if I remember correctly. Because, you know, it's, it's pretty... I mean, it's not super easy, but it's not that hard, the first areas of the game. And it's even to the extent that we've done it, with the exception of maybe one or two levels that were kind of difficult. For the most part... Okay, let's see. There's probably nobody in here, since these have been locked for like 200 years, but... There's a corpse. What is on it? Robe. A terror wand. Let's take that. I have boots now, and a gemstone. Yeah, we'll take those. Thank you very much. Oh, pardon me, sorry. What's here? This journal was a record of all the servals who required discipline, the punishments given, and the results. The vast majority of servile problems were settled with isolation. A few servals needed corporal, corporal discipline, and every month or two, one servile required reabsorption. Yikes. They just absorbed the... Ugh. Basically, execution by absorbing them, the essence that's in them, I suppose, if I remember correctly. That's pretty grim, pretty gross. Because, you know, kind of like how we, re we if Odius here can absorb any of these, reabsorb any of his creations, I guess they can do that to, to serviles. Discipline chambers, yeah, that's kind of grim. And I don't know, pretty ominous. Okay, time to go. Boom, good shot. Nice shot. Aha, you missed, punk. Uh-oh, there's more of them. But I think they're on, like, patrols, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, come on, you guys. A good punch. Yeah, dead. Woohoo! <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, steel javelins, that's fine and all, but we don't need it. Kite armor. Oh, there's two of them. Good shot. Good shot. Oh, there's another one. Chomp, chomp. Ah, uh, see, stupid. Since this. Cryora attacked him after this one did. It tried to get all the way to the most recent attack it received. Not very smart, but you know, it works out well for us. Ooh, good punch. Here, you get him. Oh, come on, dude. Get your button gear. Oh, I can't find my way. He is a thought. Yes, yes, you are a thought. You are very dumb. Alright, alright. Where are you? Right here. Yeah! Here, you move. And get him! Oh, come I said get him! Thank you. And you shoot him. I don't want him going after him. Alright, cool. 
Oh, nice punch. Ah, oh, terrible. Terrible. Here, let's cure. Spitfire. Get him. Get him. Nice. Haha. -ha. Stunned and slowed. <laughs> That's a good bite. That sound, though, it sounds terrible. Ugh. <laughs> oh, for goodness sake. I wonder, I don't know if there's an infinite supply of these. Or whether you can get them all. Let's start make our way this way. You missed. You didn't. You got punched in the head. Got punched in the head. And I missed. That's great. <sighs> hmm. Let's try speeding up. Let's try speeding up. That's a good trick. <laughs> All right. I forgot. Cry him out. Come on. Don't embarrass yourself. That was a good shot. <laughs> Yo, man, this place, they got this place locked down. For real. They weren't joking. Uh, servile, was it Greeter? Is that his name or it's just he is the Greeter? I bet you it's his name and his function. Since, you know. Imagine Servant Mines, because Control 3 I think is a Servant Mine, probably. Yeah. And we got a level. Got a level. Got a level. Woohoo! This hall is where young serviles received instructions in their given tasks. A classroom. Huh. I'm sure that's where they learn socioeconomic theory. You know. <laughs> Since economics traditionally speaking, was always considered one of the servile arts, and rather than the, one of the liberal arts, so obviously, you know, it would be something that serviles would do. <laughs> Probably not. Another classroom. Huh. Well, that's cool. Interesting enough. Oh my goodness, dude. Stupid roamers. I'm a guardian roamer. Ugh, you're annoying is what you are. I'm a stupid thod. I'm gonna run around. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, here, just stand still. Thank you. And let's say cure cryo. All right, cool. Cry about. Dooby dooby doo, dooby doo. Oh, there's a nest. There's a nest. Get the nest. A venom baton and a silver. We'll take the silver ring. Venom baton's not worth carrying, really. Nothing here. Up, oh, two nests. Darn roamers leaving their nests everywhere. Get the raid. Ugh. Gemstone and eh? two living tools. Nice. That's a good find. Actually, let's save right quick since we've made a little bit of progress. Alright. Let's see. Let's look at statistics too. 
We have six points. It's kind of disappointing because in the later games, it's always just five points. Here you feel, because I, I played this game actually after I played the others. And I was like, whoa, six points to skill points. That's a, 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 an embarrassment of riches. <laughs> uh, maybe not, but, well, that's how I felt. That it probably isn't an embarrassment of riches, but definitely seemed that way. Excuse me. Now, what should we do is a good question. We could, we just got a free point of endurance, if you recall, which is really nice. Which gave us, you know, not a respectable amount of hit points, but slightly more survivable. We might actually survive getting, you know, multiple paper cuts. But, um, I was thinking maybe we should put it into intelligence so we can get more creations. On the other hand, putting a point into leadership and a point into mechanics again would not be remiss. So, what do you think? Of course, a point into shaping skills is also is good too. Of course, we could put a point into spellcraft. That would be getting. I think getting up to spellcraft three would be helpful. But I think I'm going to go with uh, no. Come on, think, think, think. Peck, peck, peck. I think maybe I'm going to go with. I think I'm going to go with leadership and mechanics. Anything else? We could up heal craft. Healing craft, that would, that's always a good thing to up. Hmm. Luck, I'm not going to worry about. You know what? Healing craft is always useful. Let's up healing craft. There we are. Healing craft, leadership, and mechanics. That's very useful, although sort of not as exciting as more intelligence, so you can summon more minions. Darn it. That was really not helpful. I totally just sort of like, I totally paused. Okay. Please don't kill Evodius. <laughs> oh, he just ran around. He's like, what the heck's going on? No, he attacked Evodius. You jerk. Evodius, buddy, you need to um, go over here and heal yourself. No, let's actually, no. This is time for a healing pod. And where's a curing pod? Is that a curing pod? Yes. There we are. See, sometimes pods just you over you. The more powerful you get with magic and all that, the more you tend to overlook the importance of. Hey, where do you think you're going? You don't get to do that. You don't get to leave. Uh uh. Roamers, get over here. Ah. There we are. This is a much better situation. So we have our front line of thods and then our range fighters and then Evodius. <laughs> I stay safely in the back, but you know, he's worming his way right through our line. Pretty, pretty good. And he's gonna get punched in the grill for it. Punch in the grill. That's right. That's what you get for your trouble. A punch right in the grill. And there's one for you too. No one goes home empty-handed. Everyone gets a punch in the grill, or whatever that is. A blob of magical nastiness. Heal everyone up, especially Evodius. Wow, we found two of them just chilling right here. Guess what? This is a shaper inspection, and you guys are not compliant with code. These bear chambers were used as recreation halls for young serviles. 
Serviles can be playful creatures enjoying games, sports, and swimming. Shapers always give serviles leisure time. Not doing so can make them upset. Yeah, there's, again, what serviles all, shapers always do. What shapers are supposed to do in the main is... Of course, not always what they, they all do. Might as well fine, but nonetheless, you know, there is such a thing as being prudent and imprudent, even for unpleasant shapers. <laughs> Something that, you know, I think a lot of employers don't seem to grasp is that, and of course, you know, there's a bit of difference between serviles and, you know, wage employees. A lot of employers seem to not grasp at all that if you give your employees, your workers have time, reliable time off, not like, oh, they can be called at any time and sort of guilted into working and, you know, or, that, you know, have some sick time so if they're sick they can stay home. They feel better about their work. They they do better. Their employees have a better. They have more morale, if you like. A lot of them don't seem to grasp as they they're very short-sighted. And the same thing, thing. The shapers have a this awareness, even given all their unpleasantness, that servals need to have time to kick back and relax. Of course, you know shapers have other problems, but you know that's just one thing. You must be close to a shaping hall. This is an antechamber where shapers leave their dirty robes, boots, books, and supplies. It is customary to do, to do shaping with as few stray items around as possible, since magical energy can affect the process in strange ways. Yes. Again, being careful is important. Caution, like laboratory rules and all that sort of stuff. Shapers are always big about that. And not doing so causes all sorts of calamitous results. Calamity. This is a large abandoned shaping hall. This is where skilled shapers could actually form using nothing but care and essence, new serviles, oranks, and other creations. Because of the effort it takes to create them, to make them, serviles and oranks are usually bred and not made. So this chamber was probably used to produce thods, artillas, and other martial sterile creatures. The chamber has three round, smooth stone platforms, which are what shapers usually are use as a surface to make creations. No particular reason, just more organized and easier to clean. Uh oh, what is that? That looks like a, a wraith? A spectral Vlish. It's kind of beefy too. Eh, it's not that beefy, but it's probably hard to hit. Ah, oh, well, we hit it once. Good job, Cryomo. See if Spit no, that was Spitfire. Come on, Crymo. Good job. Wow, that was a good hit too. Haha, and he missed. You missed. You missed, you missed, you missed. What an idiot. Uh, what an idiot. Yeah yeah. Get some. Woohoo. I'm gonna leave you right there to cover our back. Get the flush. Yeah yeah! That Vlish was taken down by a Vlish. <laughs> the violence of Vlishes against each other is just so sad. Actually, I don't know what a spectral Vlish. How does that even work? A spectral Vlish? I'm not sure. Well, it's one thing I don't even know if I know what a spectre, properly speaking, would be. And if so, how is it being attacked, hit with physical things like you know, balls of ice it's magic ice yeah magic ice I don't know all right Whoa. uh oh something something is here let's actually what do I have to beef everyone up let's do the speeding up Can you go out there? What do we have? Burning turrets. Two burning turrets, all right. Those are both shoot acid forms. Pretty powerful. Ah! Ow. Ow. Oh man, that really hit hard. 
Kill him. Get him. Let's cure you. And go get him. Nice. You come over here. You get in here. Huh. 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 Let's cure one. All right. All right. Wow, that was something. All right, well, actually, I think I'm going to end this episode right here, and we'll continue on the exploring this facility in the next episode. Take care, y'all.